Have you settled down from your little tantrum, Oswald? It is useless. That sword contains my power, as per the contract. It will never harm me. Many have pledged their souls to me in exchange for power in life. But not one of them has been able to interest me. But you, Oswald, you are different. It seems you will be able to entertain me. But if you wish to defy me, I shall need to discipline you. I will scrape out your bowels until you beg me for mercy. Ah, but worry not. I shall not allow you to die until I am bored of you. You're interrupting an important conversation. That shameless fool. How uncivilized. Listen carefully, my dearest Oswald. A man will be arriving soon. I would like you to get rid of him for me. If you do this, I shall stop tormenting you. Cut me open if you want. My Oswald, I apologize if I have offended you. Please, dear, I shall free you of the shackles that rot your body. Nothing has changed. I only serve a new master. From an ambitious toady to an autocratic empress. Who do you want me to kill? Your sword is more than a match for the evil jewel thief who approaches. Your name will go down in history, Oswald, as the man who killed Demon Lord Odin.
Lay down your sword. I accept defeat and shall leave this place. Do you really think I would let you survive after we have fought? Let me show you that naivety has no place in battle. Wait! Is this how you show your loyalty to the Fairy Queen? No. I am no longer associated with that place. You are in the Netherworld, yet you still live. I shall not inquire as to how you ended up here. Shadow Knight, if you desist, I shall take you from the Netherworld. I know of a path that lets me freely come and go from this realm. Or would you rather become the Queen's servant and rot here? Is that what you wish? I have no one to pledge myself to. Your terms, I accept.